Pope Benedict ventured out among the public again today, only three days after a woman knocked him down in St. Peter's Basilica in a major security scare for the Vatican. Alan Pizzi has more. Security for Pope Benedict XVI's visit to the soup kitchen for the poor was notably heavier than normal for such events. Vatican bodyguards flanked his car, and Italian uniformed and plainclothes police filled the street. In an effort to underscore that security concerns are not going to keep him isolated from his flock, officials made sure children were lined up at the barrier for the pontiff to greet. The warm reception notwithstanding, the security detail looked decidedly unhappy. Even before the incident in which a woman tried to grab the Pope during Christmas Mass, senior Vatican officials had wanted this event to take place inside the safety of the Vatican walls. It was Benedict himself who insisted that he would go to the poor, not the other way around. Sharing a meal with the poor on the day the Catholic Church celebrates the Feast of the Holy Family is a long-standing tradition, but this was the first time it has been done in a soup kitchen. Benedict sat with a homeless woman from Afghanistan, a Nigerian, a Somali woman, and a 90-year-old Italian man. The charity helps more than a thousand such people on a daily basis. The real meaning of the visit of the Pope means is that the poor are part of the family. And another meaning of this visit may be that for Benedict, charity trumps security. Alan Pizzi, CBS News, Rome.